Hey guys and welcome to PrimandPrep.com. If you have never heard of us, you should definitely check us out. We are all about male grooming, wet shaving, uh, we do a lot of reviews and just give a lot of advice. So if, if you're in the wet shaving community, you definitely need to check it out as something that you will not regret. Uh, today we're going to be doing a sandalwood shaving cream review by Taylor of Old Bond Street. This is one of the most popular uh, shaving creams on the market and in the DE wet shaving community. Um, it's, I got the shaving cream a long time ago. I've been using Taylor of Old Bond Street for years now, uh, only second to Pro, Pro Rasso. That was my very first shaving cream. But I am doing a sandalwood shaving cream, but they also have a um, shaving cream for sensitive skin, which we rated the highest rated uh, shaving cream for sensitive skin is my favorite one. If you have sensitive skin, uh, definitely check this out. Um, but this review will mainly be talking about the sandalwood. Um, so let's get right into the scent. So it has a very strong sandalwood smell, I, I won't lie. But scent sandalwood is one of my favorite scents, probably next to bay rum as uh, my top two or so. Um, I really like it. Like I just opening the lid, my whole bathroom smells like sandalwood now. And I say it does have a slight hint of mint, maybe mint and citrus. Um, but overall, I really enjoy it. And uh, for a cream, it's a little bit harder than most creams. Um, it's not as hard as the soap, but definitely uh, harder than most of the creams that I own. So you could either take a little bit out and put it in your shaving bowl when you're um, getting ready to lather, or you could load just like it's a sub. You could load your brush just out of here, and that's what I'm going to do because the tub is actually really, really perfect for loading a brush. So today I'm going to be using my Edwin Jagger Best Badger brush in my Edwin Jagger porcelain bowl. I, I like using porcelain bowls because it maintains the heat, and uh, there's been hot water sitting in the bowl for a few minutes now so it's nice and warm so let's just load right out of right out of this tub uh, so we can get started um, okay guys and this is about how much shaving cream I usually use um, to get to build plenty of lather this definitely will build enough lather for easily three passes probably four possibly five so I'll empty out the majority of the water out of my Edwin Jagger porcelain shaving bowl and I really like how they have ridges at the bottom. It helps build a lather um, better than just a standard cup, mug, or bowl. So let's get started building the lather and see how, see how it goes. All right guys, so here is the final result. This is about a minute, minute and a half of whipping up a lather. It definitely builds faster than most, most shaving creams or soaps out there. Definitely faster than soaps, but creams in general build a little bit faster than soaps do. So uh, here it is. It's, it's very, very dense. It creates a whole bunch of lather, as you guys can see. Uh, if you guys can see that very well, hopefully. But... Oh um, man, yeah, it's, this stuff is like, it's sticky. It, it creates like amazing peaks, um, very, very small air bubbles, moisturizes your skin very well, and the aroma just comes out as you're building the lather so much. It's crazy. My whole bathroom smells like sandalwood right now, which I love. Um, in terms of performance, this thing, uh, it works fantastic as shaving cream. Like, it's... It's unbelievable. Like this, some of the smoothest passes that I ever experience um, with any shaving cream because it's so thick and it really gets into the base of the hairs where the skin meets the hair. Definitely, um, since it is such a potent uh, smelling shaving cream, it does slightly burn my skin, and I have kind of sensitive skin. Not like super sensitive, but uh, relatively, it kind of burns and it leaves my skin a little bit drier than I would like, but. Um, but overall, I think it, you get one of the best shaves with this cream. No wonder it's so popular. But yeah, it's um, it produces enough shaving cream for easily four, four or five passes. Um, so yeah, the tub is 5.3 ounces, and it costs $17, which is a little bit over $3 an ounce, which 
It's definitely a premium shaving cream. Um, but for the lather that you get and the performance that it has, it's worth it in my opinion. If you really love wet shaving uh, and you haven't tried this out yet, definitely, you know, definitely try it out. If you have sensitive skin, go with the sensitive skin shaving cream by Taylor Vold Bond Street. It works. It lathers just the same. You get the same performance. It's just more gentle on your skin. Uh, that's all. So um, I hope you guys like my review of Taylor Vold Bond Street, primarily the sandalwood, and you know, give it a thumbs up, please, if it was helpful. And definitely head over to primandprep.com. The link will be in the description. Lots of reviews on safety razors, brushes, bowls, uh, shaving creams, etc. Um, toast, lots of information on wet shaving. So if you're into that kind of thing, check it out. And besides that, guys, have a good one. I'll see you in my next review or informational article on the Prim and Prep channel.